Hi, here at Stamping Sue in Connecticut.blogspot.com. Today I'm going to take all those backgrounds that I did and we're going to cut them down into what I call layered crooked cards. Here's a few I've already started to do. As you can see, I have a lot of them to finish up. Now what we're going to do is just take a regular note card. I already have some tape on there. Now, I just put tape on there. I use my ATG gun. And I just... I'm not one for measuring. We'll move these out of the way. And then we're just going to take one of the layered cards. And we're just going to place it on top of that tape. So it doesn't show anymore. Like so. So now we have all that on there. And we have the back. Then we're going to go over to the guillotine cutter. And we're going to turn the card over. And just cut off all the excess. I find it easier to do it on the guillotine cutter than a personal cutter. Because those blades aren't always sharp enough. And then, voila, we have a layered card. We have another one here. Turn it over. Just line it up. Cut it off. And one, two, three, we have another card. Flip it over. Off. And one more. Oops, a little short on that one. Okay. And the last one. Cutter out of the way, remove all the scraps, and then what we can do is just layer up some images. I have this bird here that I was just thinking of putting on the bottom of the card on this orange one. Like so. And then taking some leaves. Probably easier if we use glue. Just put a little glue on here. And I was thinking of taking this one, whoops, and just layering it from the top. And taking these two, Layering them on the bottom. Like so. I usually turn it over and tap it off on the scrap paper. And there we have a finished card. We can put a saying in there later when we know what kind of card we want to do. Then we got another one here. And just layer a flower on. I already have some tape on the back of it. And the 
hardest part is getting the liner off. When you have the excess there, you just fold it back on. And take this off. And then you can just put this on like so. Take a pair of scissors, snip off that excess. And again, once you know what you want to do with the card, you can put a saying on here. So here we have one. Let's put this funky guy on there. Voila. Let's see. How about this gray one? Just put the bird on there. I think he has tape on the back. Just remove the liner. Just put him on there. A little saying on there. When in doubt, put a bird on it. And I think that's enough for today. Put together these layered cards, crooked layered cards. And as you can see, I have a lot more here to put together. Oh, here's a couple more that I put some images on. So thank you for visiting stampingsueinconnecticut.blogspot.com.